everyone do you want to export orders for sending order data to third party drop shippers updating your accounting system or for analyzing your order data well here's a solution to that because in this video i'll show you how you can export woocommerce orders and order metas for free i'm aparna singh from learnwo and let's get started For this particular process, we will be using a WordPress plugin named Advanced Order Export for WooCommerce by Algol Plus. This plugin is very powerful to help you easily export WooCommerce order data. With the help of this particular plugin, you can export any custom field assigned to orders, products, coupons. Along with that, you can also select various formats to export the data, such as in CSV file, Excel sheet, and others. So now let's start the process. For that, let's first install the plugin. First download the plugin from the link mentioned in the description. A zip file will be downloaded. Now let's install the plugin. For that, go to WordPress dashboard, plugins, click add new. Now go to upload plugin. Now upload the zip file of the plugin here. Once uploaded, click install. And once installed, click Activate. After the plugin is activated, go to WordPress dashboard, WooCommerce and Export Orders. Here enter the relevant details. You can filter orders by order date, modification date, paid date or completed date. Next, enter the date range. That is the range between two dates that you want to export the orders. Like here, I have selected from 1st July to 30th November. Similarly, you can also select the order range. However, since I don't want to export order according to that, I won't mention any. Next, select whether you want the summary by customer or summary report by products. Let me show you how both looks. First, let's see the summary by products. Select the summary by products. Under the export file name, change it to the name that you want it to be downloaded and stored. Next, select the file format. Here I've selected the Excel sheet format. However, you can also select other options like CSV, XML, PDF, HTML, etc. Choose the format according to the requirement. Let all the other details be the same like the date and time that will be automatically entered. However, if needed, you can change that too. Then select the sorting order like here I've selected that the order ID will be in descending order. Next, let's see how to set up fields to your order export. For that, click set up fields to export. To add fields manually, go to the drop down on the right hand side and click add fields. Select the meta key or manually type it here. Well, the meta key is used to retrieve the saved value from the database and display it. The meta key fields can be used to export the order meta value set by third party plugins. Now give a column name, select the field format. And once done, confirm. Once it is confirmed, the new field will appear. Drag and drop it to the list of fields on the left hand side. Now here you can also rearrange the order of the fields in the export order report. Similarly, you can add as many fields as required from the various already available fields given here. Once entered all these details, Click Express Export. And since we had selected Summary Report by Products, so the Summary Report by Products is downloaded here in Excel Sheet format. Now let's export Order Summary Report by Customer. Let all the other details be the same and just select the Summary Report by Customers instead of Summary Report by Products and change the export file name so that both the files don't mix up. Once done, click Express Export and Export Order is being downloaded in Excel sheet format here. Now let's see how these files look. 
Now this is how the summary report by products export order looks like. You can see the various export details like SKU, item name, item cost, etc. And this is how the summary report by customer export order looks like. You can see the various export details like name, company address, etc. Basically, the entire details of the customers and all the order details as well. And that was all. From this video, you can see that exporting WooCommerce orders isn't that difficult if you use the Advanced Order Export for WooCommerce by Algol Plus plugin. And the best part is that you can do this completely for free. Well, if you like this video, give a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thank you so much for watching. I'll be signing off and we'll see you in the next video.